I have been typecast as the guy to go to for the cold things, but one of the most satisfying things in the last wee while has been working on coral reefs. And in particular with an organisation called the Khalid bin Sultan Living Oceans Foundation. For the last five years, the Living Oceans Foundation scientists have been going around the world, diving in different countries, examining the state of coral reefs within them. Because the simple fact is, if you want to measure long-term change, you have to have something to start from. The hope is that by 2020, 20% of the world's coral reefs will be marine reserves which are protected from fishing. And the work that Living Oceans Foundation does is very important in deciding where to establish those reserves. When you get water which is warmed more than normal, washes over coral reef, the coral turns white effectively bleaches, it dies. Now it can recover quite quickly if the water cools down, but sustained high temperatures will kill off a coral reef. I was on a recent shoot in the Indian Ocean. The water was like being in a hot bath. It was over 30 degrees centigrade. And we could see this coral whitening almost before our eyes over the course of three or four days that we spent on one reef. The remarkable thing is that before it goes white, it goes the most amazing colours of pink and blue and yellow. It's almost like a sad last farewell that this coral reef has and then it goes white. If that warm water didn't persist too long, the coral will recover in a remarkably short period of time, just a few months or even years, it will look as good. But of course the danger with climate change is that the warmer water is happening more often, more frequently, and the coral reefs just don't get a chance to recover. So what we're seeing is it's not caused by humans living close to it, it's caused by the change in the Earth's atmosphere as a whole. And the giant challenge we have is changing human nature and, and learning to be altruistic on a scale which has hardly ever been seen before. <laughs>